Welcome, Commander. The Wehrmacht Italian Coastal Battle Group is one of two new battle groups coming to the Hammer and Shield update on December the 5th. This battle group promotes hunkering down, creating defensive lines, and whittling down the enemy with powerful artillery. Both battle groups will be available in Hammer and Shield, which is available for purchase on Steam and CompanyofHeroes.com. If you own the Premium Edition, you will receive it for free on launch day, or you can unlock the battle group using merit earned by completing challenges. So let's take a look at what's new under your command. The Italian coastal is split into heavy fortifications and coastal forces. Let's review coastal forces first. Coastal reserves are a six-man squad immediately available upon selecting the battle group. They might not be leading any heroic charges, but they will serve to bolster your defenses and work best when firing from fortified positions. Besides getting an extra squad mate at VED2, this squad will slowly replenish their numbers for free when near bunkers, and benefit from many other abilities available in the battle group, such as the artillery officer. The artillery officer provides an array of supportive bonuses. Friendly units occupying the same sector gain increased construction speed and ability recharge times, making the artillery officer a great unit to move around to establish defensive perimeters. With veterancy, the sector bonuses will also include accuracy increase, damage reduction and suppression resistance. The artillery officer also has three abilities. They can watch an area and call in a light bombardment when enemies are present. Supervise buildings to increase production speed or increase the rate of fire of a bunker. And lastly, at Veterancy 1, can inspire nearby units to increase their rate of fire and accuracy. The OBJ-210-22 is a large howitzer emplacement that is constructed by pioneers. Its shells are capable of damaging anything it hits, making it one of the fiercest artillery pieces currently. Nothing hits quite like this. Coastal Wall reduces the manpower and munition costs of your field defenses. Fighting nests, mines, bunkers and bunker upgrades are all effective. It might not be quite as flashy as the OBJ, but it will help you create mighty, impenetrable fortifications for much less command points. And it synergizes well with many abilities from the Heavy Fortifications tree. There are two new bunkers for the Italian Coastal Battle Group, and by choosing this ability, your pioneers will be able to construct them. The Command Bunker reduces the damage nearby bunkers receive and can be used as a retreat point. The Anti-Tank Bunker is a Pack 40 contained in concrete. Let's see the enemy decrew that. Designate Defensive Line can be used on a sector point or bunker. Once activated, it will restore the health of nearby infantry and reduce incoming damage. This ability will persist until the sector is decaptured or the bunker is destroyed, making it an extremely strong defensive ability the longer you can endure. I'd find a key area you want to defend that's likely going to see a lot of action. It might even dissuade enemies from attacking in the first place. Designate a bunker with artillery overwatch, firing artillery at nearby enemies in vision at a moderate cost of munitions. Building bunkers in key positions will be integral to getting effective use out of this ability. Getting more bunkers on the field will give you more freedom with other battle group abilities, like artillery overwatch or designate defensive line, as well as replenish your coastal reserves. Rapid fortification will help by granting you a bunker that can construct itself at a reduced cost. If your positions are getting hammered and you need to hold the line, then call in the reserves. All bunkers will provide free reinforcements periodically and make infantry harder to hit. It's the ultimate defensive ability to use when trying to hold off multiple enemy advances. And lastly, Bulwark is a passive ability that increases the health of your bunkers. Bunkers will also self-repair when out of combat, which will be extremely useful if you've created a complex network of fortifications. You're now briefed on the Wehrmacht Italian Coastal Battle Group. Any questions, then ask them in the comments or the Company of Heroes Discord. Defensive playstyles can be tough for the enemy to break through, but if you can endure their attacks, victory is yours.
For more information, check out companyofheroes.com and the Steam Store page. You can check out the new US Forces Advanced Infantry Battle Group in our previous video. And in our next video, we'll be covering the new British company coming to the Italian Dynamic Campaign. My name's Anuki, signing off.